When you're doing an analog mix on the Audient console, you're probably going to want to route some signals to some external effects. You can return those back to the dedicated stereo returns or to channels on the console. I'm going to show you how to patch both of those. Down here in the patch bay is where all of your aux mixers live. What you're going to do is grab the output of the aux, so for example, aux 1. You're going to take it down to the tie line, the input of the external reverb. In this case, it's tie line 9, and I'm going to grab the stereo output, so that's going to be 57 and 58. And I'm going to return those up here to these stereo inputs, either 1, 2, 3, or 4. So I'm going to go to the left input for stereo 1 and to the right input for stereo 1. That will return aux 1 to this stereo 1 return. Now if you're do, doing something like the Moog Delay where you want to route the output to a track, instead what you can do is use aux 2 output to the Moog. In this case, using the patch legend here, you can see right here is the Moog input 24, output 72. So we'll take 24 and then out. You, instead of returning to one of these stereo returns, you can go to any track you want. So 24, for example, going into tape in. And that will return the Moog's return here to fader 24. So that allows you to utilize either the returns or channels or uh, faders for your returns of your effects.